everybody welcome back my channel healthy dick 1047 my name dragon the dragon with you a good day and now here is the official news follow me One, ahead of Singham again release. Ajay Devgan and Rohit Shetty announced theatrical re-release of Singham Ajay Devgan's 2011 film Singham is set to be re-released in theaters ahead of the Diwali debut of its sequel, Singham Again. Director Rohit Shetty announced the re-release on Instagram, sharing a motion poster featuring Devgan in his iconic role as a righteous cop. The re-release aims to rekindle excitement for the franchise before the new installment arrives. 2. Amitabh Bachchan's most successful partnership has given him 11 hits, it's not with Jaya Bachchan. Rekha, Shah Rukh Khan on Amitabh Bachchan's birthday, it is revealed that his most successful on-screen partnership, in terms of box office hits, is with a surprising co-star. Rather than the more commonly associated names like Rekha or Jaya Bachchan. Throughout his illustrious career in Hindi cinema, Bachchan has formed various popular collaborations. But this particular actor has emerged as his most frequent hit partner. 3. Sushmita Sen bows down before Idol as she visits Durga Puja Pandal with Roman Shal, daughter Elisa. Watch Sushmita Sen visited a Durga Puja Pandal in Mumbai with her boyfriend Roman Shal and daughter Elisa Sen, looking radiant in a printed green top. During her visit, she bowed before the idol and greeted the priest. Before leaving, she interacted warmly with a group of needy women and children, making promises to help them. 4. Aditya's seal on Kel Kel Mine's box office failure. People who watched it called it a laugh riot, exclusive in an interview with Hindustan Times. Actor Aditya Seel discusses the failure of his film Kel Kel Mine and his role as a gay character in Amar Prem Ki Prem Kahani. Despite Kel Kel Mine's disappointing box office performance, Aditya remains positive, valuing audience appreciation over commercial success. The film, released on August 15, received positive reviews but struggled against competition from Street 2. Aditya reflects on these experiences in the interview. 5. Made in Heaven actor Arjun Mathur marries girlfriend Tia Tejpal in intimate ceremony. See first pick actor Arjun Mathur appears to have married his girlfriend Tia Tejpal in a private ceremony, as a wedding photo of the couple has gone viral on social media. Although Mathur has not officially confirmed the marriage, the image shows them in traditional attire at the Mandap, smiling at each other amidst a decorated setting. The photo was shared on Reddit with a caption indicating that Mothar, known for his role in Made in Heaven, got married recently. Six. Deepika Padukone opens up on being criticized for her diction accent. Negativity is sometimes a good thing. Deepika Padukone recently discussed the criticism she faced regarding her diction after the release of her debut film, Om Shanti Om. In an interview with Ariana Huffington, she reflected on how the negativity impacted her early career but emphasized her positive approach to handling it. She mentioned that the negative reviews influenced her perspective on her work. Deepika is set to appear next in the film Singham Again 7. Kabir Bedi slams actors for rising entourage costs. Making baseless demands of producers Kabir Bedi recently discussed the issue of entourage culture in Bollywood during an interview. Criticizing the increasing costs associated with actors' entourages.
he highlighted the differences between the Bollywood scene and that of the West. Betty shared his own experience, stating that he only employs a reasonable number of staff, including an attendant and a makeup artist, and believes that many actors' demands on producers are excessive. His comments align with a growing conversation among filmmakers and celebrities about this issue. Betty is also promoting his memoir, Stories I Must Tell. 8. When happy and proud, Ashwarya Rai cheered for Amitabh Bachchan on his national award win for Pa Amitabh Bachchan, who turns 82 on October 11. Received the National Film Award for Best Actor for his role in Pa in 2010. The award ceremony, part of the 57th National Film Awards, featured a memorable moment where his family, including Ashwarya Rai, Jaya Bachchan, and Shweta Bachchan, cheered for him as he received the award from then-President Pratibha Patil. Bachchan is celebrated for his versatile performances over a career spanning more than five decades. 9. Influencer mimics Shakti Shetty from Sing Em Again in viral video. Internet says, acting better than Deepika Padukone, influencer Sonalika Puri's mimicry of Deepika Padukone has gone viral. Receiving praise from Reddit users for her impressive impersonation of the actor's dialogues and expressions from the trailer of Sing Em Again. While Deepika's performance in the trailer has garnered mixed reactions, with some viewers unimpressed, Sonalika's viral video has captured the attention of fans who appreciate her talent. 10. Jigra Box Office Collection Day 1, Alia Bhatt. Vedong Reina film opens to lukewarm 4.25 crore rupees, is a no-show in Telugu Jigra, directed by Vasan Bala and starring Alia Bhatt and Vedong Reina, had a slow start at the box office. Earning 4.25 crore rupees net in India on its opening day. The film, which features an emotional action storyline, received mixed reviews from critics. With some praising it while others were less impressed. Despite being released during the festive season, the audience response was lukewarm. But there are hopes for improved performance during.